Hundreds of seniors in Central Florida won't have to worry as much about the power going off when bad weather hits. West Jews Bob Hazen rode along with a nonprofit that's handing out portable power stations to people who could be most at risk during a disaster. Good morning. We followed seniors first volunteer Joan Fisher today as she knocked on doors with a 24 pound box that can keep a home running after a disaster. I'm very excited because if we lose power, I can charge uh, my phone and other devices. Seniors first got 300 of these portable power stations. There are a thousand watts. They have outlets for AC power along with USB plugs and they're designed to tide people over until the power can come back on. And that's why I say it's so crucial that they have access to reaching out to people for, for help, whether it's a neighbor, a friend, emergency services. These are basically small generators. They can charge cell phones, but also run a small refrigerator or fans, TVs, even medical equipment that cost around $800 a piece. Seniors First does Meals on Wheels in Orange County, and this is part of their program to get their clients ready for hurricane season. The nonprofit got the money to pay for these 300 units from the state. An army of volunteers is, is making sure they get into the homes. And these are all going to clients that receive our in-home services, homemaking, personal care. Mm -hmm. The power stations can be charged up by plugging them into the wall or with a solar panel. Michael Blair told me he hopes it'll help him keep his devices on even when the power's out. It, it keeps me connected to the world, and that's the big thing. In Orlando, Bob Hazen, West 2 News.